Sam Baylor is a Boston area guitarist and singer-songwriter. He's been a part of bands and also performs solo. And last November, he released his first EP. Uh, and he is currently working on his first full-length CD release, anticipated to be out any day now in February. Um, and also, Sam has been busy. He is still in college, uh, uh, but in his uh, skill and love of music, he has produced at least two CDs, or ha is working uh, presently on one also, um, and also works on his own music, which is uh, very interesting of lyrics and sound as well. And I look forward to hearing what he has to share with us this morning. And I invite you all to please welcome Sam Baylor. Texas from this place that I call my own. So take a picture over here and a picture over there. Don't it seem to pass the time to take a picture over here and a video over there. Send it off to ABC Company Africa from this place to pick up your friends from down the street so take a picture over here and a picture over there don't it seem to pass the time to take a picture over here and a video over there then send it off to ABC Company. 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 Thank you. face of the moon I thought that they both were asleep the ground feels so sharp my shoes tread upon 
Like zebras who run underneath I can hear their lips rolling Sidestep away from the man underground I can hear their hands shaking Spin, move away from the unpleasant sound And all of the while I wish you could see what I see All of the while the face of the moon continues its winking at me Who looked at who from the edge of the desk Direction is always too vague For all that I know I'm looking at paint That someone put on with a shade I can hear my heart beating Too late to talk to the man underground I can hear my eyes rolling Walking away from without a sound And all of the while I wish you could see what I see All of the while face of the moon continues its winking at me Thank you Those were both original songs uh, not available back there, but available on the new CD. It should be should be out in a couple of weeks. Um, Sambaylor.com. I'm gonna do another original song now, and it's new, and it's called "Thing Gets Done." Give me a pitchfork and I'll give you back a very modest thank you. Toss me a stone and I'll pat you on the back with trembling hands. Just want to get better at the instruments I have And I don't want to listen to the footsteps of my dad The schoolyard beckons with a slightly different route But that involves the sound of my father's foot I guess I wouldn't call it fun done thing gets done thing gets done hopped on the train when I was looking for a moving place to hide Got to the museum, and I found the entrance was the other side. 
just want to look at the pictures on the wall And I don't want to listen to the barking of my mom The parkway tells me of a more attractive choice But that involves the sound of my mother's voice It always finds me a new coin points, the extra points. Then gets done. Five minutes? Okay. All right. I'll do one more, and it's a song called Lake Williams, um, which is on the CD in the back. And before I do that, I will say thank you to Cheryl for having me today. It was a lot of fun. Stop. What? Nine minutes. Nine minutes? Okay, I'll do two more. Two songs. This is called Check in the Mail. Check in the mail To see the mailman as he tries not to fail To give the goods to all the people on my block The living, breathing flock of the neighborhood Running downstairs To check the timer on the marshmallow squares Those tasty treats as they're cooking away Baking today on the block the living, breathing flock of the neighborhood And then the light bulb suddenly dies You try to fix it, but the spark's not flying It seems as though that it's trying to hide from the block The living, breathing flock of the neighborhood in the dark he's sniffing grass all through john smith's lawn you know the guy that keeps the monsters away so people can stay on my block the living breathing flock of the block the living breathing flock of the neighborhood thank you all right so i'll do one more but before i do that Unless Cheryl interrupts me again, I will remind her, I will thank her for having me today. And thank you all for coming. And this is my last song. I'm Sam Baylor. See the other side It's hidden by the pine trees But I can see just fine Gonna take a walk By Lake Williams The boats are out today
visions in my head Can't seem to find the time I'm living where I've never been I think of what I'll find The sky is painted blue and white The people kiss and say goodnight The cars whoosh past without a honk No one comes in without a knock The downtown square is full of light The future of the kids is bright Police protect you on the scene The local news on TV screens The green grass on the football field Provides a loving, bristly shield And every person fits just right Happy people far inside Take a walk by Lake Williams. The boats are out today. I don't have a dog to walk with me. Now I'm lonely, that's Thank you very much. I don't know where the miles have gone, where the hours have risen and lain. These beds of earth that I've rested upon have been washed like sheets in summer rain I pray for strength to wrestle the snow While leaves of autumn color my brain As days turn to seasons I need to know Have I missed your birthday again? Did you pour yourself a tall glass of wine? Turn to the window and whisper a name It's alright if it's all in my head Have I missed your birthday again? I hear you warm and safe on your bed A hand to cling to as the darkness wanes Yet do you wonder why the moon turns red Why the wind sounds familiar Like a passing train See the glow of a vagrant's fire That warms my cup in its low blue flame Does your home fire heat match my world desire? Have I missed your birthday again? 
Did you pour yourself another glass of wine? Turn to the window and whisper a name. You've had your life to live and I've had mine. Have I missed your birthday? Have I missed your birthday? Have I missed your birthday again? Did you pour yourself another glass of wine? Turn to the window and whisper a name. It'll be alright if it's all in my head Have I missed your birthday? Have I missed your birthday? Have I missed your birthday again? Thank you very much. Ahab was a peerless captain, a master of the winds and currents, who knew the oceans like the streets of his neighborhood. In his cabin, with his maps spread across the oaken table, he could chart the migrations of all the whales in the world. But his scrutiny was fixated on the conceivable whereabouts of the lone white whale among the million blue and black. Such odds might seem diminutive to the wagering public without the means to calculate the godly power of vengeance that might be evenly possessed by both man and whale. Though Ahab believed he was fated to be the slayer of this demon Leviathan now, he could be surprisingly compassionate when it didn't involve straying from his course, but cold-hearted as King Herod when it did. Our great planet seemed shrunken to those oft sailing round it. The hunt for a solitary less daunting with only four oceans for evasions. Indeed, Captain Ahab found his whale and the largest of the oceans, and got close enough to harpoon him, the penultimate high of scorning God's plan. For the harpoon is the vital connection between the whalers and the whale, shifting the odds to the whalers in the normal scheme of things. But the white whale proved to be fated himself to foist upon Ahab more havoc than he could muse, singing the same refrain, vengeance is mine. As the whale, too, was determined to end Ahab's unflagging bitterness, first taking his leg, then his life, along with his ship and once innocent crew. Oh, the tragedy in the winds is the twist of fate of said crew who were stalwart in their mission before acquiescing to iniquity. It seems faith is man's weakness when it overpowers his reason, allowing folly the opportunity to become the preferable option. So these whalers handed over their faith to their captain, who was cogently strewing visions of doubloons such leaders prone to madness brandish arcane ingenuity, beguiling their followers into craving their own doom. Yet the sea gods ease off and release the lone whaler, who then struggles to reconcile his good fortune with his guilt. Having seen the light from the depths, but stripped of shipmates, he must distance himself from vengeance if he's ever to shrink the void. Thank you. and pear, apricot, then this. 
Hi, I'm Jen Belisi from Golden Pond Assisted Living in Hopkinton. Staying active is essential to happy and healthy aging. Golden Pond has activities for seniors and people of every age. There is a diverse range of opportunities to be had. We've made some friendships, not acquaintances. If you'd like to participate in any of Golden Pond's upcoming events, visit the events page on Golden Pond's website or call 508-435-1250 for more information. We hope to see you soon. Hi, we are the girls from Girl Scout Troop 72969 from Hopkinton. We would like to thank Mr. Trojan for the awesome tour of the H Camp Studio. If you are interested in fun and adventurous field trips, we recommend one, to learn a Girl Scout Troop, and two, visiting H Camp to see how local television is created and produced. We also want to give a shout out to Kalala Supermarket to thank Dale for our Girl Scout Troop tour. And for always giving us a space to set up our cookie booth. Speaking of cookies, our favorites are... Thanks a lot. Caramel Delight. Thin Mints. Thin Mints. Thin Mints. Thanks a lot. Thank, thank you! There we go. And... Action! We also, give a, we also want to give a shout out to... Go. This is going to be the one. You guys no, we are the girls from Girl Scout Troop. Hi, we are the girls We're trained okay, professionals. Here we go, ready? Faces here. Big smiles! Right, here. How do you feel about that? That was awful. <laughs> that was awful. <laughs> that was yeah. Cut! Ooh, that's we a did it! We did it!